All right, man. We're here with Javier Vargas, is that right? Yes, sir. When did you start school here, Javier? Oh, uh, well, about four weeks ago. Mm -hmm. Okay. August, August 16th. And when did you graduate? Or, I mean... Or finish school? July 16th. July? Okay. And when did you get your CDL? Uh, today, August 13th. Congrats, man. Thanks, sir. Where did you take your test? Oh, uh, what is it called? It's called DPS. Over in Dell City? Yeah, Dell City. Okay. How'd the, how'd the test go? Uh, you know, just nerve-wracking. Nerve <laughs> really? Really? Yeah. Like not do much about it, just nervous. Like, uh, did you, did, were there any parts of it that you are particularly nervous about? or? No, it's just someone someone just sitting there right next to you and right. just judging every move you make. That's what, that's what makes it nervous. Right, <laughs> right, right. Where the, who is, uh, who is the, the, what do they call them, the guy that's, or the person oh, The officer. The officer. Who is the officer? How are they, how are they today? No, not, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> like strict person or? Yeah, you kind of look like a serious person. Like an old school kind of guy? Yeah. Did he did, did he give you a good score? No, I don't know. I didn't really look at that. <laughs> enough to pass? Yeah, enough to pass. Enough. I was already worried enough. I'll bet, I'll bet you're glad to be through with it. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, like, when tell us about how you found the school. Like, what got you here? Like, a little bit about getting into the program, what your, what your expectations were and stuff. Oh, well, the company I work for, uh, they were looking around for, some, for a school to get my CDL since they're helping me out. And they found this school, and they were like, yeah, let's try it out. So I was a guinea pig. And <laughs> they sent me here. Okay. Can, can we say the company name? Oh, uh, yeah, it's Producer Service. Produ okay, what, are they, what do you guys do? Uh, pretty much all the food work, fracking. Okay, okay. So you, are you going to keep working for them, you think? Yeah, yeah, I'm going to keep working for them. What, what, you, uh, what are you going to haul, you think? Uh, we're a little just bit everything? Equipment, equipment around whenever we need it. Moved to different locations. Okay, out in Hennessy. Yes, sir. Around the Hennessy area, Kingfisher area. Right okay, okay. Um, and what were you doing before, like w working for them before you came to get your CDL? Oh, well, I was working for, them for like six months. So I guess I. Okay, so what were you doing before uh, for what was the company's name again? Production uh, Services. Producer, producer Services. Yeah, Oh, uh, well, I was an apprentice for an electrician. Okay. There in town. And uh, you just, you heard about them wanting to hire a truck driver or you wanted to be, you asked them or what happened? Yeah, they were hiring class A CGLs and I applied and I've been there for six months and they finally found a school that they they were worth the, they right. were taking me to or sending me off to. Right, okay. Well, what do you think about the school? Uh, to be honest, it's not bad. I, I actually liked it. It was a, a lot of practice, a lot of driving. Uh, my uh, instructor, he really, it was kind of just go with the flow. He he corrected every every small mistake he made. He knew he knew what it was immediately. Right. There was no doubt about it. Right. So like, what was what was your average day like? Walk me through like what you guys would do. Uh, we'd start off some. Someone uh, driving out of here usually depend depends on on the day, I guess. Right. Going forward and all that. Uh, overall, the day. Some days it's just just driving, just driving for like an hour and a half. To uh, other days it's just uh, working on your backing. You know, just pair a little parking, the alley dock. Yeah, I meant what to, to ask you what you had today. Did you get the alley dock or? Uh, I got the parallel. Oh. Yeah, driver's side parallel. <laughs> How'd you do it? Oh, uh, real good. Nice, nice. Yeah. I bet, see, I, that, I would be most nervous about that, I think. Yeah. The backing part in general. Yeah, it was, it was most, for me, it was most the driving part. <laughs> right. I don't know why. Right. So did you, I guess what I was trying to get out earlier is, did you feel like you knew much about trucking coming in? Uh, I knew a little bit of it, but pretty much learned a lot here too. Right, yeah, like, do you, do you feel like you learned what it need, like what you need to learn to pass your CDL and stuff? Oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. Okay, um, was there like anything that you liked about how we taught that helped you learn, maybe take your nerves off a little bit? Oh, pretty much just preach it every morning, 
or every morning in cab or in outside pre trip, whatever. A, B, C, every every morning, just repetition. And that got in your head, and then you finally just go over there and you're like thinking, hey, I know this because you practice it every morning. It's right. Just something you're going to learn. Kind of becomes a routine. Yeah, it's a routine. You, the, and your company is going to expect you to be able to do that kind of stuff, you think, yeah. right? Yeah. Um, well, all right, man. Is there, is there anything you'd like to say to somebody else that might be out there wanting to get their CDL and they might be thinking about coming here but don't really know for sure? I mean, it's it's worth it. I think it'd be worth it. Real real good people, nice people. They, they teach you everything you need to know. They're patient. They got you. I mean, everything you need to know to pass your test right there. Right here. Well, you're proof, man. We yep. appreciate you and thanks for doing this video. Yep. Thanks a lot, man.